Today I'm gonna to be putting together this clock. This is an oversized DIY wall clock. And it's goes. it's meant to go directly on the wall. I don't wanna put mine directly on the wall. I'm gonna cut a piece of wood into a circle and then I'm gonna attach the pieces to the piece of wood. So I'm just gonna cut that now. I just have a rectangle piece or a square and I'm gonna show how I'm gonna cut it down to a circle and I'm gonna use this jigsaw that I just got. I've never used one before, but I'm gonna see how easy they are to use and um, try it out with this. So let's see how this goes. I'm using this very thin piece of plywood. I want a 40 inch diameter circle. I'm pretty sure that's what I'm looking for. So, in order to do that, I'm going to measure this string out at 20, and I'm gonna tie it to this pencil. This is gonna act as a compass. And then I'm just gonna mark where the 20 inch line is on the string. So that's where my 20 inches is. So we see where the little purple dot is on the string. I'm just gonna bring that down and tie it right around this. And I'm gonna mark on the wood where that middle part is. And then I'm just gonna go around and make my circle. It looks pretty good. Um, it doesn't have to be exactly perfect. We'll just we have the center marked, which is ideal. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and try out this thing. Hopefully I don't cut my hand off. All right, so here's the final circle. So I'm gonna sand it down a tiny bit. Some of the lines are not exactly straight, so I'm gonna try to straighten that out a little bit more. Oh, I'm pretty happy with it. So I'm just gonna start painting. So these are the instructions that come with this and these instructions are extremely vague. Um, it's telling you to nail the hook on the wall. This is the hook right here. This is the mechanism. This is the little circular piece. Using the hook, we're gonna hang this with this piece hanging facing up. So wherever the top of the clock is, my 12 is gonna be right up here. This piece has to be facing the 12 and it has to be having this slanted side facing out. This is gonna hang off of here. And then these are the hands, the minute hand and the hour hand. I'll take those out. and it has this little plastic sheet on it, so we're just gonna take that off. I'm 
we have these three pieces here. This little bracket, the flat one. Then we'll put this one on. I have this little hole to be at the top. And then the next thing is the hour hand goes on and then the minute hand. And then we'll just attach this last piece here. For the hook installation, we'll just use the clock to determine where it's gonna hang. And that's where the hook needs to go. So we need a hammer. And the next step is to measure for where the um, numbers are gonna go. And this is what we have for the numbers. These are Roman numerals. Just pop these little styrofoam numbers out. So we just use this thing here to map out the numbers. So this gets taped onto that circle and then you use the straight line indicators here to determine where to put each thing. So we're gonna start with the 12, the three, the nine, the six, you know. And I have everything marked, so I'm going, to, I'm going to go ahead and stick on these numbers. The set also came with these metal covers that go right over each of the numbers so instead of having the foam look it'll have more of a metal look so I'm just gonna add those now and then it has a little plastic seal that needs to be peeled off of each one 